Hi there, I'm Don Carricker with IWantAGreatHomeLoan.com and welcome to another edition of You Ask and We Respond. We've been asked the question lately of how do you establish credit if you don't have any? And I know how important it is because you can't get a loan if you don't have credit, whether it's a loan for a car or for a house. So I'm here with my oldest son, Alex, who also works with us, and he established his credit right off the bat when he turned 18. And Alex, how did you do it? What ended up happening? Well, the very first thing I did was went to local bank here in town, and I had a car that was paid off, and we got a small loan. Now, that, that wasn't a Ferrari or anything, right? You had, nope. a, you had a pretty cheap car. Yeah. I don't want to give anybody the wrong impression. No, but a $2,000 car I paid cash for, and we went and got basically a small loan on it, about $1,000, and then I took 12 months to pay it off just using the loan funds. I didn't buy anything with the loan. Mm -hmm. So after that, after I had a small credit score, probably 680, mm -hmm. I would say I went to, um, there was some online offer for a credit card, $500 limit, okay. and there was an annual fee with it, but I figured if I'm going to have a credit card, I can always cancel it later if I get some other credit cards that have a better terms. After building up your mm -hmm. credit. And then when I was 19, back in 2009, I ended up applying for a home loan, got a duplex, and I was just working at Domino's full time at that time, but we took my co sign mm -hmm. for it. We took the opportunity of the first time home buyer tax credit, um, and then we were able to do it that way. And how long do you own your duplex now? Uh, five years. Okay, so to, to restate what's happened, you were 18 when you turned 18 years old, mm -hmm. you got you had a car that you already had already paid for, right? so it was phone free and clear, and you went to a local bank, got a $1,000 loan on the car, put that money in that bank, did you put that money in the bank account there? Uh, I think I did, yeah. Okay. And then you used those funds to make the payments on the loan. Right. And then after you popped a credit score mm -hmm. by having that, then you were able to get a credit card from uh, an online bank. Yep. And then how long was it after the time you got your credit score till you bought your duplex? Just like a year mm -hmm. or so? Yeah, it may have been like eight months. Okay. So almost a year of it. And then how long were you working at? At Domino's when you were when you bought your duplex, I've been there for two years. I've been been yeah. figured out to be after two years. Mm -hmm. So, car loan, that's free and clear, credit card, duplex, all before you turn nineteen, or by the time you turn nineteen. Yep. And that's what you need to do to establish your credit. Is you have to have something of collateral that you can take to a bank or a lending institution. You know, a credit union is good. They'll usually give you with no credit at all. Can't have bad credit, you know. Can't have any bad hits on your credit, but you've got to have no credit. Be what we call a ghost, and get a loan against it. Put that money in their bank, preferably. They'll want you to do that. Use that money to pay the payment for that loan over the next year. Get a credit card, and then at that point, as long as you've been working at you know the same job for two years, you have to have that good history. You should be able to be able to purchase a house, and have your credit established and once you get once you had the house loan mm -hmm. then your credit score really boosted up yep. after you made payments on that for probably six months or so yep and do you have any idea you're probably in the 700s now um yeah and you're how old 25 25 so that's what it takes it's not rocket science it's not hard to do uh establish your credit do it first thing and get things get your kids started get your children started at the age of 18 to establish credit and then one thing I do want to point out as well is, like I said, you can't have bad credit. And something that happens a lot lately is identity theft. So I would recommend to lock down, uh, freeze your child's credit before they turn 18. And then you'll be able to have a perfect history of you know, no bad history on your credit by that time they turn 18. And we'll talk about, there's another video where we talk about credit freeze and how to protect your credit. So thank you, Alex. Appreciate it. And that's the last of I want a great home loan .com, And you ask and we respond. We'll have a new one coming up later on. Have a great day. And we'll talk to you later. Bye bye.